Good morning, good morning, good morning. Let's do Aquarius. I just did my Libras. Let's do Aquarius. Let's see what we're looking at. Rala, first couple weeks of April 2019. Aquarius. Well, that one is a fly out. Acceptance. Okay. Um, empathy at the bottom of the deck. Being open to seeing both sides of a situation. Okay. Um, this is learning that there's, there's things that just can't be changed. And it's accepting. I, I, I will say for damn sure, purple is your color right now. Um, so... Let's see what you're looking at. Aquarius, Aquarius. I just saw my big chubby Buddha. I just saw my big chubby Buddha in the deck. And the Empress. I see them both. <laughs> I keep seeing them. I keep seeing them. All right. So, Aquarius. Raw love first two weeks, please. of fire, patience, um, the fool. So I think right off the bat is, you know, taking a leap of faith, okay, um, you have the wheel of fortune, uh, you got the major arcana, that's a major, major energy, you got the king of earth, so my Aquarians right now, you know, the fool is, to me, is always Aquarian, Pisces energy. Um, and strength at the bottom of the deck, you have the Ace of Water. So, it's like, something, I guess, you know, something can be victorious. Um... I don't, you know, I don't feel like, I don't know, I don't know what I feel here. Um, there is definitely healing that's, that's required in, in a situation here um, in order to take a, a leap of faith for sure. There is something going in someone's direction. Um, so I don't know if the universe is saying just be patient, you know. Um, you got the king of earth here, so this is either a king of pens, so this is either you, my Aquarian's energy, or external energy, and you have strength, so you, you know, it's like you got four major arcana. It looks like your love chakra is being opened. It also looks like there's a queen of earth here. You know, so it's like... It's like the masculine energy needs to strength right now. There, there's something. It looks like there's something that's definitely going to go in your direction. But it's like whatever this is requires patience and a leap of faith for sure. Um, so there's something external. Okay, There's definitely something underlined here because it's like seeing both sides of a situation. So it's almost like you need the strength to go in. It's like my Aquarians need the strength to for change, to accept what's happening. Um, so there's definitely something underlined here, okay? Because see, it's like it's not showing me what it's not showing me two sides of anything. It's just showing me you know, what, what your energy is like. It's like, okay, you want to take a leap of faith, but it also, it, you know, patience to accept what's happening. Um, so I almost feel like, I almost feel like you don't want to accept something. And, and clear as day, it's like you don't, you don't want to see someone's side of the story. But the wheel is here. You can't change that. All right, so it's like have the strength to take a leap of faith. And during this journey, it is most definitely going to require patience. Tell me about patience. 
but it looks like something can work out in your situation. And it is te is temperance. So it's like you haven't healed from something that's happened in the past. Or you're not willing to accept, forgive, whatever this is. Tell me about the fool. The devil reverse. So coming out of toxicity, addiction, fear, having the strength to step in. Um, you, you're really coming in as this, this cappy energy for sure. Tell me about the Wheel of Fortune. Five major arcana, guys. This is like, and, and then seven, okay? Because you got two major arcana on top of the five. Like, holy moly. Like, the universe is like up your ass right now. Tell me about the wheel. So, damn. <laughs> Another major arcana. And it's reversed. So it's like you're not using your intuition. Or there's a secret that needs to be told. But to me, you're not you're not using your intuition with whatever this is. Tell me about uh, strength. So it's like every major arcana is being clarified with another major arcana. So, oh, holy shit. Every single one. Okay, eight major arcana. Um... I don't know if eight means something to you, but I will tell you, like, it's like having the strength to, to reveal something. Something's hidden, okay? The king, of, the king of Earth, which is my Aquarian, is hiding something. It looks like the secret's going to come out. There's, there's no way around it. It's sitting on top of the wheel. If it's a secret, the secret's coming out, okay? Um, it, it's like you're slowly letting go of this fear in order to take a leap of faith. But with patience here, have patience on yourself or the past or whatever's going. It's the six of wands. Something can work out. And I don't know if it's linked to love or not. But that's this right here with temperance being reversed, that's the whole not being open to seeing both sides of a situation. So. Looks tough. Alright, so let's see what I just want one card. For my Aquarians, um, kind of, it's not even the best advice, it's kind of like the energy that's just, that's around you, what you need to adapt to, um, this is, this is a lot, okay, creativity, so, and at the bottom of the deck, there's a friend, all right, this, there's somebody here that the universe wants you to create with. Okay, and this is like a, a twin card, but it's like both of you going on a path, and it's like they want you to create it. Look at the beautiful color. All right, it, it's seeing both sides of the situation here. So, you know, to me, it definitely looks like something's hidden. I don't know if you're Leo energy, Leo's, you know, it's, it's something that's not, it's unknown, it hasn't been revealed. But with the wheel here with the high priestess, this is this is whatever secret this is that this king of earth is holding, it, it's gonna come out. But it's okay, it's saying it's gonna be victorious. Okay, but there's gonna be patience that's that's needed healing from whatever's happened. Okay, so I'm not too worried about the fool with the devil being reversed, because that's coming out of, you know, fear like energy, karma. All right, so it looks it looks good. It doesn't look bad. It's just it's accepting what's happening. So if if someone's not accepting, if you're in the energy of not accepting, it's gonna make it a lot harder. Okay, and it's like I don't know if you like the whole impact thing that's happening to you right now because it's like I don't know what's happening to me. But it's like to me, it's more like stubborn energy, you know, um, choosing not to create, choosing not to go on a path. Choosing for your heart chakra not to be open. You know, um, definitely a woman in this situation that looks like, you know, life partner, king and the queen, court couple. Okay. So, again, it's like very underlined messages from my zodiac so far. But enough information for you to, you know, to hopefully pursue. And, you know, all this major arcana, they, they really, really, really... It's like, be open to taking a leap of faith. Be open to seeing someone else's side of the situation. Be open to 
discussing what needs to be discussed, telling the truth, revealing something. Okay? I love you guys. Have a great week. Bye.